If Taiyi was inclined to breathe, this cave would be the last place he would do so. Death saturated the air and soil of this wretched cave, and not in a good way. For humans, he could only imagine the assault on the senses. Eloise wrinkled her nose under her thin balaclava. A few golden curls had come loose in the fighting and framed her round cheeks, flushed with exertion. She coughed delicately into a gloved hand as she stowed her crossbow across her back. Mon prince, this is even worse than the last one. Even without breathing, Taiyi was assaulted with a sickly, sweet stench of burnt flesh and old blood. His hunger, ever indiscriminate, awoke at the hint of blood, old and congealed as it was. Taiyi quashed it down. There was work to do and little time in which to do it. His prey, O'Malley, continued to elude him. Ever since Taiyi had discovered the abomination of the Renfields, he'd become obsessed with tracking O'Malley down and permanently ending the unholy experimentation. But his quarry had proved elusive, always one step ahead. Taiyi hated that, resented the notion that O'Malley could evade him, even after Roxy had injured him so grievously. Taiyi couldn't confirm, but the rumors were lurid. O'Malley was permanently disfigured, somehow wounded beyond his hunger's ability to restore him. Or O'Malley had succumbed to his hunger and drained ten of his subjects every night to slake his thirst. Taiyi hadn't risen to be his mother's whisper master by believing rumors. But O'Malley's patterns had changed after his encounter with Roxy. O'Malley continued to evade capture, but he was clearly taking more risks and losing assets. Why the change, which posed two pressing concerns for Taiyi? What had Roxy done to damage O'Malley so much? And how could O'Malley still elude Taiyi's vast network of spies, despite being injured? The Roxy problem was less urgent, but more interesting. Tracking down O'Malley was more important, but Taiyi couldn't shrug off the feeling that both problems were intertwined. He frowned and moved closer to Eloise. Agreed. Let's be done with this quickly.